So my story today is called Where Does All the Garbage Go? And it's by Melvin Berger. And I really like this story. I don't like the pictures because, well, it's pictures of trash. But I like this story because it kind of makes us think about where all of that stuff goes that we throw away. So where does all the garbage go? You and I make lots of garbage every single day. Where does all that garbage go? Workers toss that garbage into, yep, you said it, a garbage truck. The truck takes the garbage to a place called a dump. Or sometimes it takes it to a barge that hauls that garbage far, far away. But the dumps around us are almost full. Look at all of that garbage, piles and piles. And if I zoom way in, you can see some of that. Looks like a Dunkin' Donuts bag. It's not a very happy place. Our environment, that means the world around us, is getting dirty. Look at the water. Does that milk jug? and that spoon and that fork belong in the water or on the ground. Why not use some of that garbage again? We can recycle it. Do you see those three bins? One says plastic, one says aluminum cans, and one says glass. You might do something like that at home. Maybe you have a recycling bin. You can put things in the recycling bin that we can use over again. That's called recycle. We can recycle old newspapers. And when we do, we can turn those old newspapers into new paper. We can recycle old glass bottles. Let's see, real close. And when we do, we can turn those new, those old glass bottles into new glass. Old plastic can be recycled too, and it can be turned into new plastic. And old cans, there they are, can be made into new all sorts of metal things. It's really hard to see, but those are hundreds and thousands of crushed up cans that they're gonna make into new things. What about the rest of the garbage? We can solve that too. We can save leaves and grass clippings and fruits and vegetable scraps. And those types of garbage can help our garden grow. Some of it we can't use again. Some garbage we can burn. And when we burn it, it can turn into electricity. Electricity that we need all around us for your computer, for the lights above you, for your TV, for your iPad. Less garbage will help keep our world clean and the world around us nice and green. I hope you liked my story and I hope you find something that you can recycle. Let's make less garbage.